Elijah is 16 months old and he's, he knows so many words, he knows so many different body parts and he's just chatting up a storm. So in this video, I'm gonna share with you guys how I teach my one year old to talk. Ed, show mommy your Ed. Ed, show me your eyes. Ah? Yes, ears? Say ears. Ish. Very good. Show me your mouth. <gasps> yes, show me your nose. Where's your nose? Yeah. Nose, where is it? Show me your nose. Good job. Where are your fingers? Show me your fingers. Good job. So like, with everything in life, you have to start early. Start in my country, they would say start from the grassroots. <laughs> but from day one, from the moment you you bring your baby home, you start interacting. You start singing. You start reading. Whenever they get to that age where they starts to cool, whenever they cool, you imitate them. These things will help your baby to learn to talk. It will help them to develop their vocabulary. Whenever they get to the age, play peekaboo with your baby. These things, the interaction will help them to learn to talk. I've been reading to Elijah since like two or three months. He loves his book. We have this little sound book where you press the, the buttons and it makes the different um, animal sounds. Yes, that's a goat. That's a goat, you see? And it says, goats love to jump and skip and explore with their friends. And the goat go. And it's, we've been reading that book from day one because that's a, like a, it's a book that most kids love. I'll link it in the description. Most kids love that book because it is like an interactive book. You know, you can hear the animal sounds. The, when you press on it, you hear the chickens, the goats, the sheep, the horse just different animal sound and that also stuff like that helps them to talk and helps them to make the different animal sounds. TJ de definitely knows a lot of different animal sounds too and I and that book had a lot to do with it. The next thing that you want to do is ask a ton of questions. When I say a ton of questions, don't overwhelm them. But for example, throughout the day you'd say, hey, where is your shoes? Show me your shoes. Or you'd say, hey, where is the ball? Do you see the ball? Show me the ball. Just stuff like that throughout the day. Or you say, oh my God, I spy, I see the color yellow. Can you show me the color yellow? Just stuff like that. That helps them a lot. That helps Elijah with colors. He's starting to learn colors. I'm not gonna act as if he knows knows. He's starting to learn colors. He knows different objects. He knows his ball. He knows his ABC. Yes. My 16 month old literally knows ABC. But as I say, the little things that you do throughout your day helps their vocabulary to develop so much. The next thing is you're gonna repeat, 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 repeat like a mad person. Just repeat, keep repeating. That's how they're gonna learn. Cause a lot of times when I say something to Elijah, like I say, bottle, bottle, and he just ignores me. You know, I would say something like, say remote, say remote, and I repeat it over and over, and he ignores me. But later on, you hear him say it. So he's listening, but he's not repeating at the moment, but he's listening. So even though it might feel stupid, you're like talking to yourself and you're repeating like a mad person, <laughs> just do it and be consistent with it. Whenever you're teaching them, be consistent. Even when you f think that they're not listening, they're listening. Okay, later on you're gonna hear them with it. Later on you're gonna see them doing whatever you were saying. You're like, oh, hold up. You were ignoring me when I was showing you that. No, he wasn't ignoring you. Just didn't feel like doing it at that moment. Elijah, love praise. Praise, 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 praise. So we do activities a lot like, oh, um, take this to your sister or put the bottle on the table or take the, the, the cup to the, the to the sink put it in the sink you know send them to do different stuff but on top of that whenever they do it share their joy share their accomplishment Elijah love praise so like whatever he does we just like oh my god you did it you put the cup in the sink and we just cheer for him and he likes that and he cheers to and say yay and then he will say good job he's telling himself good job <laughs> Yes, he tells himself good job because that's what we do. Whenever he does something, I say, good job, TJ, you do whatever it is. You always 
just don't leave it open always name whatever it is that they did so yeah he tells me good job if i if if i put the copy in the sink he said good job to me i appreciate it encourage your child to talk to other people families friends we don't have much families here i have a few friends but we don't have much family whenever i'm on the phone with my mom or he talks he definitely talks to his, mom, his grandma on the phone he said grandma so that's one of his words that is he uses every single day grandma so he said grandma he says dada because he talks to his dad on the phone also mama yes grandma yes. Say, how are you? I'm fine. Say, ask her, what are you doing? <laughs> so, those words, you know, and I, as I say, I encourage him to talk. So I would say, hey, tell grandma about your, your new ball or your new toy or, you know, just encourage him to have a conversation. I would say, okay, tell grandma that you're going to sleepy time stuff like that and he just encouraged him to talk so then he would repeat what, what i said he'd be like sleepy time sleepy time and then he just find his way to the bedroom oh do you say sissy sissy say mom mom <laughs> say say push Bish. say flush Bish. say juice Bish. Good job. Say nap time. <laughs> Say apple. Ate. Say strawberry. Ewe. Strawberry. Ewe. So another thing that you want to do is join your child's play. Whenever you see that your child is playing with something that they have interest in, what you can do is get down to their level and join them in play. So for example, if you see your child playing with a box, you just get down there with them and you're like, oh my God, you're playing with the box. This is a big box. Do you want to get inside the box? Okay, now it's time to get out the box. So you, you're teaching them different concepts in, out, big, small, and... Down. Uh, down. They're gonna imitate you and that is also gonna help them to imitate your words so sooner or later you're gonna hear them saying the stuff that you said remember what I said earlier about um, them not repeating right away but you know that they're listening so they not might not repeat that moment but later on probably a couple hours or a day or two you're gonna hear them like a parrot repeating what you had said and lastly something that you can do with your toddler is sing I sing a lot. I'm, I ain't saying I'm no artist now, but I love to sing, so I'm always singing, and TJ picks up on it. Um, I realized that he also already have an interest in music. He has a ukulele, and he has a guitar, and he has a keyboard that he adores. He loves those toys so much. I'll see if I can find them and link them in the description box for you if you're interested. <laughs> But singing is something that, as I say, I do a lot and he's always singing along, even though he don't know what I'm singing. But I know that, as I say, one of these days, I'm going to hear him actually sing the song that I sing because each time I always sing this little song, Jesus Love Me, this I know, that little song that you learn in, in Sunday school, I sing that all the time and uh, I know it's something that he's going to catch on to some way down the line he's gonna catch on to it so even though he's singing in his own way no because when i'm singing he's, he's like even trying to sing over my voice so he's like on top of his voice yeah 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 god knows what he's singing but he's singing that's a great way to, to help your child to learn words it's a great way to help them to express themselves because tj definitely express himself when singing <laughs> that's 
so that's it guys i hope this video was helpful if you're new here i would love to have you make sure you hit that subscribe button and hit the bell so that you're notified every time i upload a new video let me know in the comments how old is your child and and how many words your child is saying at the moment thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video bye guys